Yeah, Charlie the King is on the bottom. Yeah, he's on the bottom. There, there we go. go. Do, do, do. Okay, now I actually am. I'm not going to be biased here, but I really enjoy um, Sweet's Pokemon trainer, and it's nice to see that he's sticking with the character. Yeah, Jake. Uh, I have to get used to the new name. Uh, Sweet T is doing really well with Pokemon Trainer. Uh, use, he actually utilizes Pokemon Trainer's, like, the different Pokemon's attributes really well. Oh, yeah, like, you have to. Using Combo Game with Squirtle really well, Kill Game with Charizard, and Recovery Game. And, and Ivysaur's everything. Yeah, Ivysaur's just neutral. Ivysaur's so great. Quite I love literally it. anything you want. Ivysaur is the main reason I picked up Pokemon Trainer. Uh, just, I mean, Squirtle, Squirtle, I think, has the most potential out of all three of them, uh, but also I think is the hardest to play. But that's that's neither here nor there. I just picked up Pokemon Trainer because I missed him. So much fun. So much fun. And I think Squirtle does exceptionally well against Spaces. Uh, against Fox, this is a really good matchup, I believe. Not only is Squirtle hard to hit, Squirtle can combo, uh, combo Spaces. Cause Not into Oblivion, but into the range Ivysaur wants to kill them at. Yeah, uh, especially since uh, Fox is definitely very much a fastballer, and Squirtle loves that. Squirtle is very happy that you're a fastballer. But Ivysaur, Ivysaur really only needs a couple of hits. Uh, forward air can kill, but pretty late, especially with bad DI. But Fox is definitely not a heavy by any respect. Uh, I think forward air could actually kill at this point. Oh my god, but up here, that was so clean. It, and going above Ivysaur is, is super weird. Because that up, <gasps> that up air is super disjointed. There's oh. no reason it should be, but it is. Eight and, uh, that and down air are just nasty. Oh, yes. So nasty. Okay, trying to cover it up with the up tilt from Charizard. Okay. Right. Nope, no follow up after uh, Fox Illusion there. And nice Tomahawk grab. Mm hmm, definitely. Oh, yeah, that was a very poorly spaced uh, flamethrower. Oh. Ah, Nair. Not I, gonna kill. I do that too. Too heavy, man. Oh, yeah. There was good. That was good. Yeah, jabs are to the rescue. Nope, getting aired out. Never mind. Just holding onto the stock because he's heavy as Charizard should oh, be. Oh, that was so attack. good. <laughs> the down smash. Who would have thought? Just to cover the roll in and the uh, uh, second place. Mm. Now the thing about Squirtle is, oh, those up tilts. Yeah, those up tilts are so good. I, I really still am not incredibly crazy about Squirtle's up tilt, but Sweet Tea just making it work. Yeah, crouch under. Wow, and he was able to jump in between the lasers to get a fully charged water gun here. Squirrel does really well against Fox. Okay, down air. Squite, squite. Forward smash, just uh, just in case Charlie was going to run in. Not wow. going to commit to an upbeat kill there. And you can tell it, like, every time... I, I basically essentially call it a call-out because uh, up tilt has no... Absolutely no horizontal range whatsoever. Yeah. And he gets him every time. He's like, dude, you need to get out of my face. Every time that hits... Yeah, like, stop trying to approach me from the top. I'm just going to hit you with an up tilt here and uh, get a few more double percentage on you. But I'm Fox. Squite. Don't care. <laughs> oh. Back into the Ivysaur here. Ivysaur. Charlie's got to watch out for the Razor Leaf setups. Oh, yeah. That grab is good, but if you whiff it, you are basically screwed. Okay. Try to go for the back here from Ivysaur, but it didn't really work out. Okay. Good Razor Leaf. Nice good Razor angle Leaf. Very nice angle. That is very much a kill throw. Okay, we might see a switch to Charizard pretty soon, but Nair is definitely going to cover a lot of bases for Ivysaur. Oh, that was a poorly spaced, yeah. Didn't really work out. It seemed like he wanted to land with a Razor Leaf so he could get a grab right afterwards, but... Uh, Charlie King was already there. Not only was he only, only there, uh, Ivysaur was still going upwards on the Razor Leaf. Yeah, exactly. Okay, good forward air. Kind of right. reminds me of Diddy Kong. Ooh. Oh man, you, you gave me nightmares now. <laughs> I have nightmares. I don't want to play uh, Squirtle anymore. Squirtle <laughs> was my favorite, but now thinking of having a Diddy Kong Ford error. <laughs> yeah, sorry I ruined that for you. Oh, that was a good nair from Charlie. Didn't really get much more of a setup, but he got a definitely a good advantage out of it. Yeah, yeah. Charlie's trying to hold on to center stage once more here. Such a good dash attack. I wonder if he's uh, buffering like an instant wall running uh, dash attack. Because if so, that's not a bad idea for Squirtle, being so small and can cross up. Not cross up, but go past your shield. Okay. All right, slow profiling, just in case. Ooh, this is about the time to switch over to Ivysaur. I feel like this is the percentage for us. Uh, percentage nice. and stock for uh, Charizard. Mmm. Good be. waterfall. Oh yeah, that's right. It's called waterfall. Mm hmm. There we go. Oh, okay. Ivysaur in the fray, but he has no jump. He's got to watch out when he's off stage. Yes, he does. Oh, that was so good. Finally Instantly going back. Get away from that ledge. He's going to back air you. Maybe 
maybe trying it down air? No. Just gonna go with a safe razor leaf into Vine Whip. Oh, that was such... That whole last five seconds was so smart. Okay, so full hop, Nair, covering whatever he can to try to stay safe as yeah. much as possible. And then he knew right after, okay, Charlie's going to chase me as soon as I'm done with this full hop because I'm completely open. He did a directional air dodge and landed safely, knowing everything that Charlie was about to do, and just got him with the forward air. That was actually Vine Whip. That's Vine Whip? Yeah. That looked like a forward air. Look, like, Vine Whip and forward air look the same, but... Uh, Vine Whip has more knockback and does kill like below platforms. Either way, that was a, that was just a really good defensive play. Forward air is just a combo tool. Yeah, it can kill though. Uh, forward air can kill uh, with really bad DI, which you really shouldn't expect. Let's just say it kills at around 160. Yeah, Charlie so. was nowhere near 160 there. No, he it was wasn't. like at 120 something. <laughs> But nonetheless, that was very good play from Sweet Tea, just Definitely. weaving around Charlie, uh, Charlie. And it's so hard because you not only have to understand Pokemon Trainer's bad matchups, you also have to understand the individual character's bad matchups. Oh yeah, no. You're uh, playing against kind of four types, uh, four characters. Yeah. Because you're playing Pokemon Trainer himself, and then you're playing the three Pokemon. You'll scarcely find a bad matchup for Pokemon Trainer. I actually think Pikachu is actually, ironically, a really bad matchup for Pokemon Trainer. Because uh, Pikachu can do, it can handle all three of those Pokemon. But this isn't Pikachu, this is Fox. And I still will say that Squirtle can actually wreck Fox. But right now, Fox is like, nah, dude, I can wreck Squirtle too. Alright, very nice withdrawal. Just gonna catch Charlie on the air dodge there. Mm -hmm. Oh, that forward tilt's really good too. Can sometimes trip, um, depending on how you angle it, but yeah. Mm. All right, spot dodge from Sweet Tea. Just mm. gonna put him back in disadvantage. I like that Danair drift. I did too. I really did too. He landed so fast. Good down tilt too. Not really the best move in the world, but it's just a good poke get off of me. Nair just to keep himself safe away from Charlie. And I mm. like the angled razor leaf, but going a little bit too hard on that Charlie picking up on it with a reflector. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, very good way to cover your bases with razor leaf. Oh. The backer too. Backer can actually combo into Vine Whip too, which is just so good. Oh, okay. Yeah, very nice. Especially on a platform stage like this, yes, you can expect something like that to happen at some point. Up tilt, I also don't think is being utilized as much as it could be. If you uh, pivot it, if you pivot up tilt, you get basically free up airs. Okay. It's it's terrible because it only has a hitbox from the back. You can't hit uh, from the front with up tilt. Oh wow! Uh, I actually did not know that. Oh yeah. And I do like that space in the back. <laughs> oh yeah, just barely hitting him in the face. <laughs> Yeah, I do like the space back there that Sweet Tea was pulling out, though. Mm -hmm. And you can see, I was actually going to call this out, like, I think he wants to grab him, because at pretty much any point in the stage with that rage, he can kill a back, a back throw. Oh, wow, side beat! Fox Illusion kill. Fox Illusion kills? Oh, Smash Ultimate, what are you doing to me? Well, oh. that Smash going to be killing at a very hefty percent there. Oh, I hate when that happens, when you can't tell if you have a fully charged water, and you just kind of, like spit it all out trying to charge it. Kind of sucks too, especially when you're switching back in. Yeah. Like you still have the invincibility frames, and invincibility frames kind of look like the charged projectile frames. Exactly. Very nice back air. Oh, oh! <laughs> I wanted that. I wanted that so badly. Me too. Okay. All right. I thought he was going to land with a Nair there. You can land with Nair, even though there is kind of a bit of a... Oh my god, those him, down airs! He hit him grounded one. He hit him on the beginning of his short hop too. What is this? What is down air? Please don't nerf. Please keep my Ivysaur the way that he is. Hold up. Up air and down air they kind of reach below and above the middle of Smash Bros. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It can <laughs> yeah. Ivysaur, I've seen some pretty nasty stuff on Twitter. <gasps> oh, no. That's not going to That was the hardest of reads. I really like that down air to stall a little bit more after the jump. Mm, that was a good dash attack. I feel like after these razor leaves, since Charlie has been either just good switch. Uh, air dodging out of the way or jumping, I feel like Sweet Team should try and get it to throw out a fair. Uh, it, it is a little bit faster, I believe, than Vine Whip. Mm. Okay, have I sort down air? Nope, not gonna hit. Oh no. Okay, trying to go for that grab. So I don't know if it would a uh, back throw would have killed from uh, where he was. I, actually, no, I'm pretty positive it would not have. Okay, I'm not so sure about that up air either, but that was a good nair. Very good nair. Putting him especially in a good advantage state. There, ah! That was such a good grab. Wow, I didn't even see that. How, like, did, how did he up. get behind him? I didn't see it. I had no idea. 
He was he was in center stage, and all of a sudden he was by the ledge with a with a grabbed fox. Mm. And I have to say, I have to give props to Sweet Tea for being able to mix up his recoveries in so many different ways. Like especially when he gets up. Oh, that was also a smart idea. He hadn't done that before. Okay. Right, angling Razor Leaf once more and oh. trying to change these back airs and just gets him killed. Oh, that makes my heart hurt. That I really thought that those backers were going to keep him in like in a pretty safe, you know, place. But Charlie's like, no, dude, I can probably just up smash through your backer. I don't care, man. You're yeah. way too close to me. And at uh, at the rhythm that Sweet Tea was doing it, Charlie just picked up super quickly. He threw out like three backers, and knew the fourth one was coming, and just up smash in between it. Yep. That's something you have to do in this game is start mixing up your timings a lot more. Definitely. Because Again, this game is heavily based on what whiffs and neutral punishes. This game is very much uh, based on footsies, yes. uh, more so than uh, Smash 4 was. Uh, this, this game is excellently, excellently designed, and you know you can you can fight me on that. Don't at me though. A very beautiful blend of melee and Smash 4 movement, in mm -hmm. my opinion. I agree. I agree. Okay, good forward air too. Yeah, Fox cannot get anything off of down air at the uh, not not down air uh, down throw. This game, I believe. Mm. Okay, I was gonna say, like, where's that water gun at? Oh, ah! <laughs> water gun into stun spore. Let's go. Oh, that's what it's called. I call it stun spore. Yeah, I, I guess. Up, up air and down air are stun spore, in my opinion. Okay, uh, I'll take a look at the character it's, archives. Yeah, in, it's in, not called that, but it, it sounds cooler and more canon. Yeah, it, it, it does make sense. Oh, okay, that was a really nice uh, landing into forward tilt. Oh, that up tilt catching him too. All right, very nice, just short hop crack. Oh, well, Ooh, that was, hop crack. Oh, I was going to say, that was almost really bad, but he still got up smash anyway, but he lived. All right, another jump nair off the ledge here. Mm. Charlie still looking for a neutral get up here. Um, pretty sure he'll pick up. Uh, he'll start positioning himself for back airs on the ledge mm. sometime soon. And every time Sweet Tea throws out the nair, it seems to hit more often than not, and it looks like he's using it and utilizing it a lot more. Good up tilt. Yeah, again, like uh, like you pointed out before, nair just covers a lot of Ivysaur, if not his whole hurt box. It does. It completely does. But the problem is the end lag afterwards, yeah. which is very minimal, uh, to say the very least. Especially when you just auto, when you just auto cancel on the floor. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought he was gonna switch to Charizard. Now would be a very good time to do that. Oh, well, down smash! Gonna take him off stage. He's gonna need a switch. Oh no! Just trusting that Razor Leaf to pull him forward. I mean, if he gets a back throw from where he is, that's definitely gonna kill. Oh yes. And we have a stock lead too. I almost completely forgot about that. Well, I cursed that. I certainly curse that. They're going to take that stock, and we're going to be switching back into... Uh, I just disagree with all of that. <laughs> okay, all right. Looking pretty good with that water gun, too. Oh, I do oh. like the down tilt. Ah! I do, too. I do, too. Don't you die here. B reverse Razor Leaf almost looking like it was going to kill him. Mm-hmm. Okay, he was just a bit missed space for that down air to... Sweet Tea is going for these hard reads right now. And that's part of the reason Sweet Tea has lost a lot of percent against Charlie. Agreed, but, but this will kill. Go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We kill. Home run. Okay. Right. No time for a grab here because of the invulnerability, but I feel like that's what Sweet Tea wanted here. Okay, good for it. Oh, uh, waste out all the invener uh, invulnerability for Charlie the King. Mm -hmm. So hopefully... Resetting neutral as much as he can. Again, he's back on the ledge here. Just gonna keep using waterfall to get back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Too yeah. light of a character to survive that. Far too light. Pretty sure Ivysaur would probably uh, survive that, being a little bit heavier. Yeah, misspacing that fair is gonna get him into a lot of trouble here. Yeah, yeah, just tacking it on with those jabs from Charlie the King. More jabs. Oh, no, 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 no. I do like those. I do like the rapid jabs he's been putting out. Not a lot of things. Uh, I don't think the Ivysaur actually has anything to punish how fast the Fox's jab is. Not really. I mean, all you can do is nair preemptively. That's one of the best things. Okay. That was a very good uh, flamethrower, but I, ooh, I really hope that uh, Sweet Tea knows. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. I hope he knows what he's doing here because Squirtle has been at kill percentage. I, I hope he switches out, like, soon. Oh, that oh, was good. Go. That's what I would have done, yeah. The water gun, just get it out there, see what you can do. Good nares, getting him off the stage. Ooh, oh, always going for read. those. Oh, oh, oh no, no, he had it too. Okay, now, t to Sweet Tea's credit,